You're watching ABC 4's Good Morning Utah in HD. Oh, get ready for a sugar rush. We are going inside the pastry kitchen at the Grand America. Yeah, ABC 4's mm -hmm. Emily Clark getting the secrets to the pastries and the sweet treats and why they're so irresistible. Emily. Exactly, they are so irresistible because this guy, Chef Jeffrey here, is behind it all. These are all his creations, so amazing. And as you said, we are inside the pastry kitchen here at the Grand America, so we get a little bit of an inside scoop. And you've got a few treats for us this yep. morning. So this morning we have uh, an espresso mousse. Uh, we have a s'more that we're going to be making. We have an orange vanilla bomb and a raspberry and chocolate mousse. I just cannot even wait. So what are we going to do first? Uh, first thing we're going to do is pipe some uh, Chantilly cream. Chantilly cream, what is? Yep. What exactly is so that? It's pretty much just a sweetened whipped cream. Okay. Uh, some people put vanilla in it, but uh, pretty much whipped cream and sugar and vanilla. Okay, fantastic. Um, and then what we're going to do is put little boules of it just right on top for garnish. Okay, now if someone wants to buy these, and where are th these are inside... These are inside Le Bon Vie, our pastry shop here in the Grand America. Okay, I'm glad you said that, because I was so afraid I was going to mess up the name. Okay, <laughs> so do we just do this on all of them? Yep, we do it on all of them, and then what we're going to do is take uh, this little chocolate espresso bean for garnish. Oops. So are those, like, what are those? There, it's just a chocolate uh, espresso that we okay. to, uh, look okay. like nice. an espresso bean. Nice. And everything we make here at uh, La Bon Vie for, is fresh every day. Fresh every so single day. Every, every day we're here garnishing everything, baking everything. Uh, right now we're baking off some pecan tarts uh, for the showcase and getting everything ready. Now, I asked this earlier, but this is actually chocolate mm -hmm. on the side. Tempered chocolate, yep. It's a chocolate, uh, tempered chocolate band, and inside is an espresso mousse and a sweetened condensed mousse, and uh, we top it with the Chantilly cream. I'm gaining weight just looking at all this stuff. It looks absolutely amazing. So throughout the morning, we're going to make all this stuff. And then later on during our 7 to 9 o'clock hours, we will go inside the bakery and check that out as well. But it is Valentine's Day, so uh, are you expecting a busy weekend? Very busy weekend, yeah. We've got some orders coming in, but uh, we'll always have products, so anyone that's looking for anything will have it. Okay, so Don and Angie, if you want to get the way to your uh, sweets heart, I guess it is through lots of sweets for this Valentine's Day weekend. So we'll be making those things coming up during the 6 o'clock hour, so we'll see you then. All right. Oh, we need some of those back here. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> well, it is now 614. If you're still struggling with Valentine's Day ideas for mm -hmm. the lucky people in your lives, we've taken care of it, sort of. This morning, mm -hmm. we're going inside the pastry kitchen at the Grand America Hotel. Yeah, I think my little guys would be really happy if I did what Emily is doing this morning. <laughs> She's getting the secrets of how these pastries are coming out at the Grand America Kitchen. Mm -hmm. O.M. Oh, we're kind of oh. jealous this morning. I have a tough job, don't I? Yeah. Very, very tough job. Hanging out here with these awesome chefs, eating all this good food. It's fantastic. So, of course, we got Chef Jeffrey here. Kind of a newer addition to the Grand America. Mm -hmm. but very we're new. Very, very new. Mm -hmm. How are you liking Salt Lake so far? Uh, so far, it's great. The people are wonderful, and the area is really nice. We're just getting used to, uh, you know, exploring the different uh, nooks and crannies of Salt Lake. It's fun. It, uh, I love it. I'm a local girl, so I'm good, good to go here. So, First up, we made this right here, which again, remind us what that was. The espresso. So it's espresso mousse and sweetened condensed uh, milk mousse. Oh, amazing. Okay, now this is really, really cool. This is kind of your own version of a, uh, of s'more. a s'more. Yep. We have uh, a milk chocolate fudge that we line with a uh, chocolate croquant. So it's like little rice pearls mm -hmm. that are coated in chocolate. It's kind of a crunch bar, sort mm -hmm. of. Exactly. And then we'll, we made this Italian meringue. So it's a fully cooked meringue. We cook the sugar and whip the egg whites and combine that all together. And it's a really stable meringue. So. When we brulee this right now, um, it's gonna taste just like a marshmallow that you roasted over the fire. So nice and gooey, and you'll have that like that burn. Mm, no complaints yeah. here. So we're gonna have fire this morning. What a good morning here for us. So you're just gonna kind of burn yeah. it. Yeah. So we have this. Uh, we have a little blowtorch. You can get at the the home improvement stores. It's a little bit better than um, than the ones you find at like Stove Top or yeah. Williams Sonoma. This is what we use in pastry shops. But pretty Industrial much. Industrial strength here. Exactly. And then so light burn, just like you would do uh, the campfire. Yeah, I personally like mine kind of burnt, but I, I love mine burnt. I'm not patient. <laughs> so we do a nice brulee like that. It smells like marshmallows. Exactly. And then we have our uh, graham cracker wafers that we make here. It's like now you gotta tell everyone about this because these things are amazing. Yeah, they're little uh, ground graham crackers that we uh, combine with some ground sugar. We put it in the oven on a flat sheet pan, and then it all melts together into this really thin wafer and tastes just like a graham cracker, and we use it as the garnish on the s'more. Kind of cool. Very, very cool. So that just goes like that, like that. 
Beautiful. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, so if someone is coming to La Bonne Vie, did I say that right? Yep, you got it. Uh, we're going to be actually checking out a little bit. What can they anticipate for the, all the different treats that you're going to be making in here? Well, we have so many different treats, uh, pretty much something for everyone. Chocolate-covered strawberries, cupcakes, all of these pastries. Uh, we do gelato and hot chocolate. Um, we have a special hot chocolate that we uh, made especially for the grand. Um, along with a lot of packaged goods, things for people to take home like dragees, uh, caramel corn, um, all sorts of things. Sounds good to me. So if you're looking for Valentine's Day, this is just where you gotta go because I'm sure that anyone in your life would love any of these desserts. So 30 minutes, we'll cook up some of these other things. And then of course, seven to nine, we're going inside the bakery. So Don and Angie, Marty, tough life for me this morning. Oh, yeah, hang out in the bakery. Emily, can I put in an order for hot chocolate? I spilled mine all over the makeup room this morning. Okay, well, I'll see what I can do Oops. for you. I'll yeah, I, I need a repeat. <laughs> Thanks, doll. She's having a fun job. Yeah, well, she sure is. Taste test that this morning. All right, 645, you're still struggling with Valentine's mm -hmm. Day ideas for the love of your life or maybe the prospective love interest. You're in luck. This morning, we're going inside the pastry kitchen at the Grand America. Yeah, nothing could win them over besides these little pastries. <laughs> if you're on that line, you may want to do this. ABC 4's <laughs> Emily Clark is getting the secrets of love. In the I kind of, of Angie, I like your idea. Yeah. Angie, I like your idea. If you're on the line, borderline, mm -hmm. we have found the solution for you. Right. Take these. Done deal. You'll get a ring. Right, Angie? No, okay, I'm just kidding. No, you... Um, let's now talk mousse. about these raspberry... What do we call these ones? Raspberry mousse. Okay, and Very this simple. is Chef Jeffrey, which I just learned people call him Chefrey. Yep, that's my Jeffrey. nickname. Mm -hmm. Love it. Okay, <laughs> so raspberry mousse here, and then these are the orange bombs. Orange bombs, yep. And what do we have on these ones? Uh, this is white chocolate shavings and an orange glaze, and inside is a citrus ganache and orange and vanilla mousse. So very orangey. Very orangey, like a creamsicle. Like a creamsicle. And then you put these cool little candy oranges yeah. on top. Candied orange peel, so we uh, peel and dice the orange and then poach it in a simple syrup. Okay, I'm going to I'm gonna try to be a pastry chef. So do you want to switch jobs for sure. a second? You can hold this. Okay, so we're picking good raspberries, right? Mm -hmm. And five of them? Five of them, however many fit on there. Okay, if I'm doing something wrong, you have to tell me here. Nope, you got it, it's perfect. I did cupcakes once, and the cupcake lady told me I was bad, so I can take it, <laughs> I can totally handle it. Now we're gonna do some piping. Yep. So what's the trick with this? Just, uh, yep, you got it, and then just get it all to the bottom and pipe it straight in, just even pressure. Beautiful. Kind of? Kind, kind of, of. Okay. you got it. We'll cover it up and it'll look good. So we have the, the sugar twheel, like that? sugar batons, yep. Okay, that and works. And we'll finish it with the gold leaf. Here, I'll hold this and you okay. can grab that out for us. And now the cool thing about this gold leaf is you can actually eat it. Mm -hmm. It's fully edible. You won't get, I mean, you wouldn't want to eat the whole packet of it, but in these small doses, Voila, beautiful. Okay, so see, fantastic. But when you come to La Bon Vie and you buy one of the pastries, it will not be an Emily Clark original, it'll be a, a chef original. Yep. So, you know, we were talking about earlier all the different desserts that you have inside there. So kind of give us an idea. So if someone's thinking, oh, what am I gonna get? My lover in my life, give us some ideas. Well, it depends on what they, ha what they like. You know, there's something for everyone, but my favorite probably is the new raspberry mousse just because I love raspberry and chocolate. Uh -huh. But um, we also have a limited edition um, package item right now. It comes in a beautiful box and it's patafui and some salted caramels. Um, really nice for sharing. For sharing. Mm. Ooh, beautiful. And then do you have macaroons? Because I'm looking for macaroons this we morning. We have macaroons. Okay. We've been hiding them from you. You've been... But they're coming. They're coming. So Don, Angie, Marty, we'll bring you back a little sampling of these treats. But of course, Grand America is a place to get all these delicious items from Chefry over here. And ABC4.com has a link to the website to get all that good information. But just stop on by because what time do you guys open? Yeah, uh, 11 o'clock. 11 o'clock. There you go. So well, come on down. You order, some we have an order from Angie and, and myself. We both want one of those raspberry The raspberry So if he's, if he's willing to part with them, we'll take them. <laughs> done. Consider right. it done. On your desk before the show's over. Did you go, say Don or done? <laughs> <laughs> done. Thank and you, on. Emily. All, of it. All right. And earlier this month, we took you inside the pastry kitchen at the Grand America. Now, to the display, Grand America's new La Bonne Vie. Yes, inside there are a lot of ideas for your Valentine or even just yourself if you need to get a little sweet fix, so to speak. Mm. Emily Clark joins us now live with more. Emily? Good morning, friends. You talk about sweet treats. Definitely a lot of sweet treats. Jeffrey and I are making it earlier, but let me tell you about the display and how beautiful it is in here. I'm obsessed with cupcakes, so I'm kind of in hog heaven right now. So let's talk about exactly what is La Bonne Vie. Well, La Bonne Vie is 
an experience. We've taken a French uh, patisserie, brought it here to Salt Lake for everyone to experience. Um, we have all different sorts of retail items, uh, different cupcakes, you know, cupcakes, lollipops, decorations, everything you could see. Um, and then all of, of course, all of the pastries that we make here. But it's just a fun place for com people to come, check it out, and do a little, uh, you know, find something special for someone. Now, that's one of the cool things about this is that it is, of course, for hotel guests, but it's also for everybody and anybody. So if you're just heading home from work, you're downtown, I just really need a macaroon, this is the place to come. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's really accessible. It's right at the front entrance. You don't have to wander in and about the Grand America. You can get in, get out, get your pastry, take it home and enjoy it. Take it home and enjoy it. Okay, now you were talking earlier about hot chocolate, so I think you whipped one up for me, didn't yep. you? Can we go grab that and give that a try? Because this is, if I understand correctly, the Grand's own hot chocolate. Own hot chocolate. So we have two. We have a hot vanilla that um, Which is... Which Randy just tried. Randy, did we like the hot vanilla? Yes, he's, yeah. yes, he's shaking his head. Yes. So it's, uh, yeah, the hot vanilla, it's a van white chocolate ganache with a lot of vanilla in it. So kind of like drinking ice cream is what he was saying. Exactly. Super, just like hot ice cream. And then and this is the our, um, it's a rich hot chocolate, more of adult style with the peppermint uh, whipped cream that we have on top. Whoa. That's kind of intense. It's very intense. The chocolate But it's very good. Very good. I love it. Now, how did you make peppermint whipped cream on top? Um, it's, uh, we flavor the whipped cream mm -hmm. and then charge it so in, we have a whipped cream canister that we uh, charge it up and put it on top. Okay, Angie Larson, this fresh one coming back for you a little bit later. Thank now, you. Now we also got gelato set up here, so kind of talk to us about this as well. We get, we have different flavors of a gelato that we uh, bring in, they're always fresh. Um, we make our own waffle cones for people mm -hmm. that, you know, you can get a, a cone or a cup or however you like it. We do, you know, uh, affogados, so espresso and gelato together, hot chocolate and gelato. Gosh. It's really tasty. I don't even really like hot chocolate that, that much, but this is amazing. Thank you so much. Wow. Okay. So, kind of taking my breath away. I don't even have anything else to say. ABC4.com has all the information, but of course, all you have to do is just drive up here to the Grand America, you know, drop off your car, take care of that, and then come on in here, and then all these amazing things are waiting for you. Now, all of my treats aren't back that we made earlier, but those are coming up, right? They're coming right up, yep. They're coming right up. So, we'll talk about that, and then also, in the next 30 minutes, if you are getting something for your Valentine, they have very special packaging here so that your treats which you buy look super cool as well so we'll talk about that but for now don and angie i'm just gonna enjoy my peppermint hot chocolate yeah thanks yeah i didn't really want to scoop up the hot chocolate i spilled all over the makeup room floor sorry about that guys so thanks for bringing me back a fresh one I could this is probably gonna taste even better, Angie. It's yeah, what? This is amazing. <laughs> it's gonna probably taste better than what you yeah. had. Oh, you, you mean, mean better the one than the stuff out of the machine? I <laughs> <laughs> mean that pasty wow. cocoa powder yeah. and water. <laughs> yeah, I'm assuming. I'm so shocked. Thank you, Emily. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Earlier this morning, we took you inside the pastry kitchen at the Grand America, and now on to the display. Grand America's new La Bonne Vie. Yeah, inside, a lot of ideas mm -hmm. for your Valentine's Day and. Even if you need a, I don't know, sweet fix for yourself. Emily Clark joins us now live, giving us the inside tour. So what do you have this time? Oh, well, this is what we have. Do you remember a couple weeks ago, Don and Angie, you had a lady on who was making macaroons, and I wasn't there, and nobody saved me uh. one. So I've been on the search for a macaroon. Chef Jeffrey here has taken care of that for me. As you can see, we've got a plethora of macaroons, and I will be trying my very first one in just a couple moments. But... Chef Jeff, let's talk about all of these amazing treats here because uh, you were making them this morning. We saw how you were doing that, but this is one of the cool parts of La Bonne Vie here is that you get a sweet treat anytime yeah. you need it. Anytime you can just walk in and grab a macaroon, grab some truffles. We have cupcakes, chocolate chip strawberries, and all the pastries that we made this morning. Oh, so amazing. Now, these cupcakes, I'm a cupcake fan, so I really like these. What, are, what flavors do you have up there? Well, one's chocolate and marshmallow, and then the uh, we have a red velvet with the cream cheese frosting, and then a peanut butter uh, with a peanut butter frosting. Okay, so amazing. And then, of course, all of these items are great Valentine's Day gift ideas. We've got all of this cool Valentine's stuff here, and then the packaging is amazing. And we talked a little bit about this before, but remind us about the his and her packaging here. Well, it's a special limited edition packaging that we have, and it's meant for sharing, and it comes together like this, and it's the salt and pepper caramels and raspberry petafui. Here are the girls, there's the guys. Mm -hmm. Okay, enough of this talking, let's get to the eating. So this is the, actually the treat that I made That's this morning, right? the made this morning, yep. And it is, talk us through what it is. It's a uh, raspberry mousse with a chocolate mousse insert and fresh raspberries and chocolate ganache. Okay, shall we? Let's just do this. I wanna get the little gold piece, because I think that's cool. Oh, not very talented. Oh my gosh. Okay, now that I've tried it, what is in that again? It's a uh, chocolate mousse and then uh, the raspberry mousse with the fresh raspberries and the chocolate ganache. 
Okay, that was heaven. And gold. And gold. I ate gold. How cool is that? Okay, macaroon. Lavender. Lavender. Mm -hmm. Oh, it like, tastes like lotion. Yeah, I mean, it tastes like a lavender. Uh, you have the initial crunch from the cookie and then the soft chewiness from the uh, filling, and it's pretty tasty. You know, I've been talking about macaroons in my head for a couple weeks now. That totally lived up to everything I'd hoped it would be. Good, I'm glad. So good, okay, so that was really, really good. You can come in here, get a treat, just park outside, come on in, drop off your car, grab these sweet treats, and of course, all the Valentine's Day packages go along with it. Chef Jeff, this was amazing. Thank you for coming. Oh, so happy to be here. This is his baby, too. So when you come on in, say thank you, Chef Jeff, for this amazingness. Don and Angie, unreal. Yeah. Treats are coming back for both of you. Don't worry. Kind of I want to see, huh? see the display again with all those the cute little goose Valentine's guys. Oh, yeah. Look how darling that is. Go up, pan up a little bit. Yeah, those guys right there. <laughs> cute. Okay. Thanks, Sam. I'm happy now. I'm taking care of Angie. All right. That was so darling. I yeah. love Valentine's decorations. And earlier this morning, we took you inside the pastry kitchen at the Grand America. And now on to the display, the Grand America's new La Bonne Vie. Yeah, well, the reason we're there is mm -hmm. just to show you all the neat ideas and great ideas that you can get for your Valentine or maybe just yourself in case you need something after lunch. Emily Clark has more. Okay, welcome back, Don and Angie, inside the beautiful Grand America in the, I was, Le Bon Vie? La Bon Vie. La Bon, I always keep messing it up. Okay, but this is so many cool things going on here. Not only do you have amazing treats, but amazing packaging that the treats come in as well. So we'll talk about that, but at first, there's all these little to-go baggy type things with really cool stuff in it. So, Chef Reed, walk us through exactly what we got here. It's a lot of fun stuff. Just, you can come pick it up and snack on. There's, uh, we have different barks. This is a milk chocolate and, and mixed nut bark. We have almond dragees. This is a candy coated. You gotta talk a little bit more about this because you gave me one of these and this is amazing. So it's just an almond basically covered in chocolate, right? Yeah, we candy uh, whole almonds. We coat them in chocolate and then we dust them with the cocoa powder. I think of all the stuff in here, that's like your healthy treat kind of because you got the protein bit, yes. of an almond. Exactly. It's completely healthy. I'm trying to justify zero it. Zero calories. Zero, zero calories. That's the name of the game. Okay, this is cool too. A white chocolate dried fruit bark. Um, that we make here, uh, the caramel corn, a little bit of chocolate, peanuts, and fleur de sel. And then our special for Valentine's Day, um, special packaging for his and hers, different pastries, mm -hmm. um, salt, and pepper, salt, salt and pepper caramels for him, and then uh, raspberry patafouille for her. Okay, you gotta talk about this caramel, because I tried this as well, I've just been, been a bad morning too much sugar but you got pepper inside the caramel and you'd think okay that's disgusting but it's amazing so yeah, talk about the mixture of those tastes well it's just uh you know you like salt and pepper on you know everything. on your food on your yeah. on everything and it's just another another flavor to introduce people to you know it's something that you wouldn't normally find but you know that it tastes good you know that you like it so why not try it and the cool thing is all of the stuff you make right here Yep, right here every day. We make everything fresh. Everything fresh, so awesome. Okay, let's go here to the wall of boxes because this is kind of cool as well that everything has its own little mm -hmm. box and it's just so beautiful. Yeah, it's part of the packaging. It's part of the experience. And mm -hmm. when you buy something like this, you want to be able to give it away in a, with a nice presentation and make a memory for for your for your, the recipient. Oh, I just love that. Okay, so uh, this is, of course, Chef Jeffrey. We call him Jeffrey here. This is kind of your baby, this uh, little area here. Yeah. So kind of, to everyone sitting at home, kind of give us a little welcome and why they should be coming to stop by and see you. Well, it's something new in Salt Lake. It's something different, like the salt and pepper caramels. Uh, something, hopefully, people haven't experienced here before. If, it, if they have, it reminds them of that time that they spent in France or wherever else they tried it. And, uh, you know, it's just a fun place for people to come hang out. It's amazing. And you don't have to be at the hotel. You can just come on by. ABC4.com has all the information. Don and Angie, I have a total sugar headache, but it is so worth it. So good. And don't you worry. We're bringing treats back to you. We'll see you soon. Thank okay. you, Emily. Emily. All right. The Daily Dish is next here on the CW.